Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Farm Sim 22. We are in Silver Run Forest. And guys, I want to show you something. I went ahead and rented this. This might be different for a lot of people on Farming Sim, but check this out. So we're going to take this up here. We got a whole big area that I've been working on between episodes. Now we took a bunch of wood over to the factory and it's getting produced. And we took some wood over to the floor tile place. It's getting produced but up here on top of the mountain. So I've cut in this road and put down some gravel. Kind of winds up the hill. This kind of goes uphill a little bit. And then we've been clearing out this plateau up here. When I say we, I mean me. <laughs> but yeah, you can see this is a nice little flat area right here, right? And it's kind of up and the house is like up there, but this kind of overlooks. If we go over here by the trees and look down, you'll be able to see like it right around where we're at. So this is, uh, the, the pond is over here on the down slope. And then we have this whole gigantic area up here. That's kind of like a big plateau. And we've been cutting down all the trees. I think I've cut down probably, probably 20 trees. I would say I've done, uh, an entire load plus a load and a half of trees one of the trees was enormous it was like this one right here i think i got like seven pieces out of one tree it was freaking amazing but what i wanted to show you guys something pretty cool so if we get in here and disconnect this bad boy let's go park this guy over here for now park him right here for right now let's turn his engine off and then let's go over here and jump in this guy let's pull him out all right so we are going if you look up at the top right hand corner it's got a terraform menu Okay, so the terraform is set to min, uh, materials and the discharge is set to materials. We're going to uh, toggle terraform mode. So we want to flatten or we can smooth or we can paint, right? If I set it to paint, right, and we go into the menu, I can go into this menu and we can uh, enable machine uh, on, disable paint. Uh, we won't keep that disabled. Let's do that. Clear material, removes material around terrain deformation. Uh, we could do that. Uh, disable decoration removal. Prevents removal of bushes. Off. Disable weed. Off. Disable field removal. Uh, okay, we can do all that. But we need to put this on material stones. This is the material that will come out of the shovel. Uh, but as far as terraform, we're just going to do this as we can do it like forest pebbles. Uh, dirt road. Road dirty. Road dirty stones. Forest pine debris. We'll do this one. And the discharge will be dirt. Okay, so we're going to do 100%. 100%. Uh, flatten 100% so that's all that right so watch this so if we enable this and I click on an enable def enable this and we put this down and I start pushing watch what happens is it not gonna work all right it's supposed to, it's supposed to <laughs> enable terraform there we go there we go watch this hopefully it doesn't so you can see that it's painting the ground underneath it's a little laggy though isn't it? it's not taking away any of the of the brush so it's supposed to it's supposed to take away all the brush so we probably want to do um uh Let's see, terraform, discharge material. We don't have any discharge material. Let's go back into our menu. So we want to make sure disable discharge, clear material is on, removes material, okay, uh, prevents removal. Um, we want to keep all this off, right? Use mass per liter. We'll turn this off. Enable machine, disable paint is off. So it should have done that, but if it's not going to do it, then we'll just do a discharge. We'll do, uh, we'll do stone. Um, I guess we could keep it on that. Sand, gravel, sand, wet, grass, grand tile. Can we do stone, sand, road pebbles? No, we can't. So that's the discharge. Okay. So we'll do, uh, we'll do this forest pine needles, I guess, forest pebbles. And then on this, we'll just do stone. Okay. That's fine. So we're going to change our, our terraform to material or we can flatten it. Right. So if I flatten it, you'll see that all the stuff goes away and I'm painting. All right. So we can do this get rid of all this stuff so it looks like i'm actually bulldozing stuff now, i don't know if it gets rid of trees it does not get rid of trees okay it does get rid of bushes and shrubs so it looks like we're actually bulldozing but if you look in front of my bulldozer blade look at this stones so what we're actually doing is we're terraforming the ground around us and we're pushing stone as our discharge so we're just going to do this and we're going to push all these stones over to an area and let it discharge. 
All right, guys, I've been doing this uh, for a little bit of time. You, I don't know if you can tell, but we've got the grade down like almost two feet from what it was. So we were like at this level here, and you can kind of see that it goes downhill. Um, it just takes a while to get all this grade. So uh, what we're going to try to do here is we own this land, right? And we can actually sell the gravel and the product that's underground so what i was thinking about doing is starting a quarry and maybe try to get uh some uh earth processing done uh just to have some fun with it and so that's what we did we went and rented this big boy this is a big old caterpillar uh it's the 99 h got a big old 19,000 liter bucket on it but we can also put this bucket on the ground and push and oh we need to activate it whoops Let's turn it back off oh we need to uh, activate it so basically what this is going to do it's going to flatten the ground yeah it doesn't look like it's filling up though so we might be level here it doesn't look like we're level because it looks like we're getting ready to go downhill uh terraform we need to put that on oh we need to change that uh terraform lower flatten there we go so now you can see that it's getting rocks in the bucket all right so we got rocks in the bucket and we need to take this over here. I brought the truck up with the uh, the tipper on it. And we're going to just fill this in. Now, we don't get very much money for the gravel. I think one full uh, load here is like 4,000. Um, you should be able to discharge it. Oh, is he full? I bet he's full. Uh, he is full. Okay. We'll just take this back to the place. So that's what we're going to do up here on top of this hill. We're going to start tearing all these trees down. We're going to start getting a little uh, quarry going here and process some of the rocks we do we went ahead and put in a uh, a rock selling spot down here at the bottom down by our little base here so we're going to take this over here and dump it um i'm going to go ahead and sleep the night and then hopefully in the morning we'll have some material available for our other um production points and then we can use that to send over to the roller coaster place and get that done. So I'm, I need to put some lights here too. So we should probably go ahead. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. Let's buy some light. Uh, let's go to construction and then uh, let's see decorations, lights. Uh, we need some pretty powerful ones here. So let's put this like here and rotate it. That looks good. And then we should probably put one back here, probably here and rotate it this way light all this up that's pretty good that's pretty good so you can see here when we when we dump this it just says stones now we could also use these stones for um uh, like lime production but we don't really have a farm right now i think eventually we'll have a farm here but i don't know so you can see we're getting uh it doesn't go up very fast so i think we get like i think it's like thirty eight hundred dollars for a full load of rocks like i said it's not much it's just uh, we might as well sell them since we have them up there. Uh, so $4,900. So I'm going to do that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and sleep the night and get some more materials. I think if we check our material, our productions, we have um, the these things here. The floor tiles getting produ produced. So we need to accelerate this a little bit. Uh, we don't really have that much material here. But we do have a lot of wood that's up at the other facility. And we're going to need to go get that too. So I'm probably going to, I think our trailer is up there. So let's go grab our trailer. We'll drive up to the house. We'll take us, we'll sleep. And then uh, I need to go shut up all the machines up here. So this is going to be a long, a long-term process up here. This is going to take a while. Basically what's going to happen is this whole hillside is going to be almost level with that place down there. So we're going to tear all this hillside out and get rid of all the gravel. So I'm going to park him here so that he can dump park that there and then we'll grab this guy here and we'll go get we'll go get um all of our uh, products in the morning we'll have to take uh actually i'm gonna leave let's leave this guy here actually let's turn him on and we will leave him here because there's going to be some rocks that we need to excavate here so we'll go park him up here by the road just out of the way we'll just park him up here in the trees right there there's a deer over there you see it one just one just ran right by us. All right, let's turn our lights off. Let's jump in our tractor. Uh, let's see, we need to pull that up. Did the tailgate go up? It doesn't look like the tailgate came up. Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. So, X, there we go. All right, so let's go ahead. We'll go up and sleep, and then I'll see you in the morning. We'll get our products, and hopefully we can get a couple more put into the facility. And... Um, 
and see how much uh, we need for the next process. So let's go up here and sleep. I'll see you in the morning. All right, I love this view up here. I really do. It's just where all the leaves just changed. It's really pretty. There's our construction site down there already. So we're going to go this way. I think this is the back way to the lumber yard. I, I, if I remember correctly. Hope it is. We'll go back this way. Um, I haven't found any more of the artifacts. So we'll we'll continue looking for those. I have no idea where to even look for these things. <laughs> I mean, I've looked in the houses. I know we still get... We need to get the one at the train station. I know there, there is one there. I'm actually going to... Guys, don't say anything. I'm going to ride down this way along the railroad tracks. Just just go with it so uh yeah that will get us out here oh there's the train too right on time all right so we're gonna get the wood goods take it to the uh flooring goods place and then the flooring goods place should have our floor tiles done and then we'll take those floor tiles over to um now did we get did we make any money off our solar panels? Um, it doesn't look like it. Property income, we did. We made a little bit. Must not been too sunshiny in the last month. <laughs> Only nineteen thousand dollars. We typically make like thirty, I think thirty, thirty-two thousand dollars. So, but once the uh, leaves go off the trees, the solar panels will work a little bit better. I think. I hope. All right. So let's go in here. Get our goods. Um, I don't see any in the barn. Is there any in there? Yeah, there's one little pallet right there. All right, we'll pick up all this stuff. Let's pull in here. I don't think we need wood beams. I, I mean, we could keep them in storage, I guess. They still sell. It doesn't, regardless. And then I need long planks. Actually, these are the long planks, aren't they? Those aren't beams. Okay, the long planks we can take to... I'm pretty sure the long planks we need at the, um, the spindle facility. There we go. Uh, I will leave those down there. All right, let's... Uh, there's like a little road out right here. All right, let's go this way. So yeah, I think we can take the long planks to the spindle factory. I think that's what it requires. I think it, it uh, the long planks actually uh, produce quicker, or you don't have to have as many for the spindles. And then I think that's it for the roller coaster for the first stage. I mean, we it's going to take uh, a really long time to build that thing. Uh, but since we have money, um, I was thinking about going ahead and buying the the uh, boat dock as well, so we could start using some of our lumber over there at the boat dock and maybe get some boats started. Because I know the boats are pretty profitable. We just have to get a lot of material there. So we're going to pass our place right here. I want to see if there's any material sitting out. There is material sitting out on the side. So let's go ahead and pick this up. So there's our spindles. We're going to grab these. All right. Let's go ahead. I don't want to hit this woman, so we'll wait for her to pass. <laughs> Actually, let's just back out. They really didn't, like, give us an opportunity to have, like, a little... Um, like they didn't do a curb cut here, so we really don't have like a true driveway here. I guess they expect you just to do curbside service, curbside pickup. So if you guys have been playing this and you uh, know where some of these things are, these carvings, uh, you let me know so I can find them. I'm pretty sure they probably hid some around these houses, but I don't know. All right, so this is this place. I'm pretty sure we bought this place. I know we're on the wrong side of the road. We bought this, right? Yes, we bought this. So this is the staircase place. This doesn't have any wood. It does need plank, uh, planks long. So we do need staircase railing, planks long. Okay, let's go ahead. Let's unstrap. All right, let's grab some of these planks long. And we will put these over here. I don't need these for the other facility. All right. All right. Is that enough? How much more can we put in here? Uh oh, it holds thirty thousand. Okay. That's a lot. All right these in here. Now we can also pay to upgrade these factories. I don't know if you guys knew that. Uh, we have a mod in here that allows you to do that. 
Let's go ahead and get these stair rails started. Okay, we got the long planks here. Uh, I don't want these, uh, so deactivate that, uh, deactivate that, deactivate these. I don't want the bowls. I just want this. So that's the only one I want to activate. And then uh, staircase, spawning, spawning, that's all fine. So it should be making these. We have 6,000 in there. Okay, that's good. All right, let's take this other stuff over. Uh, let's strap that in. Let's take these uh, small planks over to where we just picked up these um, floor tiles because we're going to need to get those. And then we'll just make a U-turn and come back. Oh, God, look at this. Oh, Link's going to love that. Link's going to love that. Oh, man, I'm like stuck in here, ain't I? <laughs> uh, I haven't done this in so long. I've literally watched uh, Link do this like four or five times. All right, so, and I even, I even uh, we talked about this on Discord, how this could actually get fixed easily on all these trailers. It's just the center of mass on them. And you can go into the XML and fix the center of mass on these things. I know this is just totally not real, but uh, you got to do what you got to do to record. And this game's got, even, even as polished as the game is, it still has a lot of flaws. And one of the biggest flaws is trailers hauling stuff so the center of mass on these things are way off here we go all right let's keep going we'll go down here and i need to dump these off in here now i don't i think we can just do this i don't think it's going to you know it won't take the other stuff it shouldn't at least all right so that's all it's going to take we'll sell the rest right, let's make a yui we'll head over to no don't tip i swear to god We'll head over to the uh, the um, the roller coaster, get these things submitted, and then yeah, I think the only thing left is the railing. I don't think we have anything else that we can sell or, pro or provide to them. I think this is the last thing right here. We'll sell that. Sell that. Uh, it's got it's got more floor tiles than it needs. So you can see that the uh, required materials for the next step is going, should be going down, correct? Yeah, it's going down, wood beams down. So it's gonna go through that. So the only thing that we don't have right now is staircase railing, which is fine. So we will take these uh, floor tiles over here, I guess, to the general store and just sell them. Probably be, be the best. We'll just put them in here get rid of them there we go so we got quite a good quite a good amount of money i think what we're going to do is go ahead and go over here and buy the um go ahead and buy the uh boat dock and uh we can start sending stuff over here now i know the boat dock requires a couple other additional items um, but let's go ahead we'll park here we'll run across the street and buy this all right so let's buy this this is one hundred twenty-five thousand dollars. oh my god all right so this requires planks oh this requires four tiles too <laughs> This requires everything. All right, that's fine. We'll uh, we'll put the wood production. We're going to need to cut down some more wood, which isn't going to be a problem. We got that whole hillside that we got to tear out, so that's not going to be an issue. So, yeah, guys, I think that's all we're going to do today. I'm going to take a screenshot of our construction process, and then uh, next episode, hopefully, we'll have some of the hillside taken out. Um, like I said, we don't really want to build houses in the winter time. We could probably get some of the ground. Uh, excavated for new homes and we might do that I might um, put the uh, dozer on the trailer and take it over we got to find a good a good site right now I haven't heard back from Michael uh, and that was our investor so maybe something that we do on our own and see how profitable it is but uh, the more factories we're building here the more people are going to move in so we do have the, the, the need at least for new housing so yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, smack the like button. Hit the subscribe button. And uh, I will see you next time.